Hi, I'm Andy Alloway. I'm the owner of Nebraska Realty. Today, I just wanted to give you a quick look at what the Omaha real estate market looked like in uh, 2017. Just on some of these numbers here, it was another really good year uh, for real estate, although it did have its challenges as well. But some of the numbers, uh, as we see them, active listings, first of all, December 31st, that's kind of the poll date that we used. There was 1,974 listings uh, as of 2017. This represents 2016's number, so you can kind of compare that. Them. So we were off about uh, down about 2% in terms of uh, total active listings, which continues to be a problem. We have very high demand from people. Uh, that's going to continue into 2018. Uh, but the number of listings continues to go down because really a lack of uh, affordable new construction going back into the market and just people putting their homes back on the market for a multitude of reasons. But uh, listings process, so we actually process more in December, 884 listings versus 726 in in 2016. So that represents a 22% increase in listings that we put on the market in December. So that's a good trend. We hope to see more people putting their homes on the market uh, this year as equities con equity continues to increase in homes and in price appreciation. Listings processed year to date. So 19,332 uh, versus 16, we we're up about 1%. So we actually put more properties on the market in 17 versus 16. Uh, properties under contract in December, again, is a good trend in that uh, 749 versus 720. So people were out in December, uh, December, January, typically the slower months for, for real estate in the Omaha market, but the trend from 16 is good, a 4% increase in terms of properties that went under contract. Under contract properties year to date, there was no change, virtually the same, 14,581, 14,586. And remember, 2016 was a record year for the Omaha area. It was the fourth consecutive record year for home sales. So the fact that we've got no change right there uh, is, is really good. Actually, it would have been significantly more had we had more inventory, more properties to sell. A little bit of a switch there. And uh, under uh, 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 closed residential properties uh, in uh, December, 1,024 versus uh, 1,130, down about 9%. So the, the properties that went under contract uh, increased, but the properties that actually closed were down a little bit. Closed residential year to date, uh, again, down about 1%. So you're talking about coming off an all-time record year with less and less inventory. Uh, you know, that, that's a, a really good trend. Appreciation was, was very significant once again for about the fifth consecutive year in 2017. Uh, average sold price uh, was 214000 This is from a year ago at 204 so we increased the average sold price. This includes existing homes and new construction was up about 5%. New construction sold, uh, we did about 1633 uh, so we're off about 100 transactions. Uh, so that was down about 6% in terms of the overall numbers. Uh, but the overall average new construction price was up 6%. So 326 versus 308 in 2016, up about 6%. The median new construction price, again, same thing. In 2016, it was 286, 304 at the end of uh, 2017 reflects a 6% increase. Existing homes sold, uh, 199,000, just shy of 200,000. That's almost a $10,000 increase, a 5% increase. Again, these are very high appreciation rates for Omaha and just the Midwest in general. And we've had that 5, 6% appreciation for about five years now. So at some point, uh, the demand is just keeps coming and, and we don't really see where that's gonna end, supply and demand. We gotta get more supply in the market and hopefully that's coming this year. Uh, existing homes sold, uh, like I said, 200,000, and then the existing median went from 162 to 170, again, a 5% increase. So this just gives you a quick overview of what the real estate market looked like in 2017. Uh, if you want any more uh, information or have any more questions, please uh, give us a holler uh, and uh, love to tell you a little bit more about what we think 2018 is gonna look like. Hope you have a great day and thanks for watching.